Hey guys, Fortnite here. Welcome back. Uh, hey guys, Spornite here. Welcome back to Pokemon Fusion Generation. I'm right back here. Um, right there is where we left off at the last episode. And here's Bill. Hi there, Bill. Let's talk. Ready? Here we go. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for your patience. I'll be glad. You'll be glad you waited because you're about to witness a revolution in Pokemon battling. So with the help of my assistant, SNR, I'm going to de demonstrate it to you with a battle. Go Pika-V! Yes, you heard that right? Pika-V! Pokemaniac Bill would like to battle. Pokemaniac Bill sent out Pika-V. This is the mascot of Pokemon Fusion Generation, Pika-V. And it's cool. <laughs> There's a hundred and... Four fusion Pokemon, I believe. Oh, I, for I forgot to turn up the speed. Oh well. Anyways. Paralyzed. Yeah, whatever. Tail whip. But... Pika V is really cool, and I know that there's a spot where I can get a Pika V. I trade a Furret for Pika V. Oh, excuse me. Not bad. Got a thousand. Behold, Pokemon Fusion. Pika V is just one of the new types of Pokemon I've created with my newly perfected Cell Integrator. Already, the gym leaders have taken an interest in Pokemon fusions and are using those these powerful creatures in battle. Soon I'll be creating designer Pokemon for the public. Now I'll be taking questions and comments from the audience. Hiker. That's amazing. I want one. Incredible. Unbelievable. Disgraceful. I'm sorry? This is an abomination. What you're doing, it's unnatural. Pokemon and I experiments they are our friends. You've gone too far, Bill. I... I don't know what to say. I guess I never thought of it like that. Who do you think you are, old man? How can you not see the cruelty in this? I'm going home. Thank you for coming. Thank you for your help, SNR. I guess I need to do some thinking. That was interesting. SNR, do you think you'll get a Pokemon fusion? That Pokemon Bill had was pretty cool, but I don't know. Do you think the old man was right? Anyways, I'm going to Pewter City. Let's battle again sometime. That was indeed an intriguing show. I'm heading back. I, I'm headed back. Your English is wrong. <laughs> I'm headed back to Pallet Town now. Come visit anytime. Good luck, SNR. Okay, so if I go here options okay let's look up in pokedex yeah so if you look fusion one two three four five six and seven are here here's pika v i don't know where the fusions are going to be can i nope i can't Page down. Yep. So only know that there's one through seven. Gotta go fast. If I need to capture some Pokemon, I'll do that at a later time. But, um, for right now, the Pokemon I have are good enough. The answer is yes, I'm probably going to get some fusion Pokemon. And, yeah, they're, the, they're friends, but still, these Pokemon fusions can be our friends and stuff like that, so. 
But as long as you treat the fusions kindly, then it's all good. Dealing with trainers, fine. Dealing with um, wild Pokemon, it's just kind of annoying, in my opinion. See, like, first little spot of grass, boom, and you hit a wild Pokemon, and it's like, what's going on? <laughs> Yes, I throw out my po Pokemon, and then I run. And then I get there, and oh, okay, it went off to the right. Cool. <laughs> Go. Route 2, yay. Um, what's over there? I don't know, whatever. Pewter City. Hello, sir. Eridos, no. Hold on, there's something written here. The Stone Gray City, cool. Whatever. <laughs> it's quite around here because everyone's headed to Cerulean to try to get their hands on a Pokemon fusion. To full health and... All of the Pokemon centers are going to be closed for maintenance. I wonder what's the fastest way to Cerulean City. Well, if we look... Oop. Uh, I need to turn down the speed a little bit. Cerulean City. Okay. So that's the way I'll eventually go, but there's a note on the door. Off to Cerulean City. Be back soon. Okay. Welcome. How may I serve you? Bye. Nothing interesting. Cool. Dun, dun, dun. You made it through the forest. I mean, I know you would. How's your training coming? Show me how strong your Pokemon have gotten. Yay. Oh. She has three Pokemon. That's fine. I can take it. I can take him. Oh boy. Your buds come here. And it'll be best to use Tackle. Tackle. The battle of the tackle. I choose the box that has tackle in it, so is that a box and tackle? That? No? Okay. Level up! <laughs> Keep going. Uh, yeah. I'll be getting rid of Growl because Growl's stupid. Poof. Oh, something I want uh, I meant to talk about it in the first episode. Um but uh has anybody seen the trailer for Pokemon Sun and Moon? It's so cool what they're doing. Um the Aloha region or Aloha it's something like that. It, it, it's based on Hawaii. It, um, Pokemon Sun and Moon is based on Hawaii. And um, I'm either going to choose Litten or the Grass Owl. I don't remember its name. But um, uh, Sleep Powder as well? No. Sleep Powder is better. But um, I'm kind of torn. Litten looks really cool, plus I can make jokes like it's lit in. Ha. Uh, <laughs> um, but I I always have a spot in my heart for all of like the grass type Pokemon just because I love them. Every generation I've chosen the grass type. Maybe if I get both sun and moon, I'll choose the grass in my side one. But yeah, um, Litten 
looks really cool. So, just want to talk about that really quick. Stop learning that. Oh boy, already 10 minutes. Um. Uh, leech seed first. Oh boy. Uh, bag. And potion. I might lose. There we go. Potion. Don't kill me. And another potion. Are the potions not going down? Because I remember having... Oh wait, no, I... I talked to the Pokemart guy and I found one in the woods, so I should have four now. Right. Silly me. Um. Leech seed now. Yay. Recover some health. And hurt by poison. Now tackle. Oh boy. Okay. Healed. I'm actually doing a lot better than I thought I would with having just one Pokemon. I wasn't expecting to go up against May if that wasn't clear. Now Leech Seed. Hurt by poison and tackle. Ugh. Fine way. Yay! I won. It's good that I was able to win because that was a little bit close. <laughs> um. Okay. There was a sound behind me. Now that's strong. Yes, I know. What? Evolving. Spin, 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 spin. And... This is weird. Congratulations, your seed ball evolved into Ivysaur. So, if you don't know the reason why I chose seed ball as the name, um, Bulbasaur on its back is the bulb which is essentially a ball that's a seed so seed ball yeah anyways moving on <laughs> I'm impressed here you should take this HM1 it contains cut yay teaches um you'll need it to get to vermilion city but you'll have to get the boulder badge to use it outside of battle I bet you're itching to get to cerulean city uh, and see Bill just like everyone else. Through, Verm through Vermilion is the only way to get there for now. Mount Moon is closed off because of the ro because of a rock slide. Better get going now. Keep up the good work, SNR. Yeah. So, um, I'm gonna heal my nope. I'm gonna heal my Pokemon again, and then I'm going to end the episode right here uh, in the Pokemon Center. So. Thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, if you enjoyed the video, make sure to leave a like down below and leave a comment. Tell me how you think the series is going. Um, I'd love to hear uh, what you think of the series, and I'm looking forward to doing more of these in the future. This has been a lot of fun. Um, so I will see you guys in the next episode. Bye-bye.